Welcome to Steve Draws. I'm Steven Groot, a Dutch artist, and in this video I'm going to talk about the new update of Procreate, and it's going to be Procreate 5. I'm really excited about this new update of Procreate, Procreate 5, and it's coming soon, in 2019. And I'm just going to go over all the new features. They have it on their site. So I'll also leave a link in the description box down below so that you can also, you know, see all the updates of Procreate 5. They're starting out with a new uh, interface of Procreate and now you can move around your menu. So if you have your uh, color disc, uh, for example, you can just you know, swipe it around your screen. So that will enhance your workflow, which is a great new feature. And they're now talking about a new um, graphic engine and that's called Valkyrie. And they're now on a different uh, engine and they use the new engine for the new brushes because you can now uh, make new brushes, new custom brushes with a lot of more settings so that's very exciting as well and they're talking about uh, brush studio uh, seeking the perfect brush to suit your style craft your own from the ground up using the built-in graphically accelerated texture gen generator you'll be able to make the brush you need in seconds the next feature i'm really excited about and that's the animated feature and in Procreate 4.3 you could make uh, small animated GIFs, but you know if you're really an animator you need uh, a timeline and also um, onion skinning because you need to know what's in front of you, the, the frame you worked on and you know the frame you're working on. So in Procreate 5 they will enhance it and they, they're calling it animation assist. And it says here offering fundamentals like onion skinning and instant playback so you can you know playback it full screen because now in 4.3 you can only see a little thumbnail so this is a great enhancement so you can really test out you know the animation you're doing animation assist gives you the power to create rich illustrative animations looping gifs and snappy animatics there's also going to be a new interface and they're going to change the interface a little bit with um, panels you can uh, reattach or just you know have your color uh, menu just float around your screen so you can adjust it so if you you know really need to pick your colors quick you can just you know uh, enhance your workflow with these floating windows and here they talk discover a spectrum of color effects that must be seen to be believed and what i'm seeing here is uh, color dynamics and they're um, going to uh, update the brushes and also how you use the brushes because in photoshop there is color dynamics in your brushes so you can choose between two colors and then make up your brush. So they're mixing the colors of your brush with two different colors. And what I see in this preview is that it takes um, the colors or picks the colors from, um, from your canvas and then mixes those two colors. So that's great, you know, if you're painting uh, bushes or more organically that's you know a great way and great enhancement of uh, the brushes and this is great if you're working in print um, they're now going to also support CMYK and that's great because when you're working in print you need CMYK you know to make your images ready for print and there's also um, a clone tool and they're doing these kind of things to procreate because there's another great app coming out i think in november and that's the new drawing and painting app of adobe which is called fresco so they're updating these things to procreate you know to keep on top of the game and that's also great you know it's always great that there are new uh, drawing apps out so that uh, an app like procreate will feel the competition and then 
you know, uh, add new features to their to their app. And they say it's coming soon. I think it will be released in November. So these are really great new updates of Procreate 5. I hope you enjoyed them and you can check them out on their uh, site and I'll leave a link in the description box down below. And also follow Procreate on Instagram because they have Instagram stories and there they also explain all the new features in Procreate. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you like it please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell because each time I upload a new video you get a notification. Drawing is fun and practice makes perfect. See you next time. Doodles!